Hello everyone, as you may have seen I had access to the Biomorph demo and did a playthrough for you all to see in my previous video. After playing it I wanted to talk about my first impressions of the game. So to start let's talk about the hints of the story. We play as a character named Harlow and their comrades Eni and Zeki, which is Harlow's fist as we can see in the demo's intro, who are trapped in the stasis field when the demo starts and is freed by falling debris. Harlow has no memory of who they are, leading us to go into the game world and find out what is going on and uncover Harley's mysterious origins. Next, let's talk about gameplay. It is a Metroidvania style game and it plays in a similar style to Hollow Knight. You can jump, attack, and as we progress through the demo, we get new abilities to use. We unlock a close range punch attack, a long range projectile attack, and a mid range attack that is like a spear. In the demo, we get one of each type of attack, and I'm curious to see what other attacks we can obtain in the full game. Another ability that Harlow can use, by far one of the coolest in the game that I've seen, is having Harlow Biomorph. See what I did there. This gives you the ability to become any creature that you kill and then use their skill sets. This can be utilised to progress through the level, for example by smashing an obstacle as a Torath, and I'm sure this ability will come in very handy to solve puzzles and obstacles in the full game. The game does have a fast travel system too, which is very handy to have. This can be unlocked after visiting Blightmoor and completing a side quest. This in turn leads to upgrades that enable fast travel between discovered safe sites. These safe sites are also where you can switch out attack chips and other mods that you find in the game. Moving on to graphics, the game is stylized in a brilliant and detailed hand-drawn 2D style. The animations are clean, the characters are quirky and ooze personality in how they are drawn. You can see this in the hub area of Blightmoor that we visit in the demo. The creature designs are also well detailed and are quite a variety of them from what we've seen in the demo so far. And the final boss of this demo is quite a sight to see. Overall I enjoyed my time with the game and I look forward to seeing what the full game has to offer when it's released. If you're a fan of Metroidvania games and games such as Hollow Knight, have this indie title on your radar. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you want to see the full playthrough of the demo, the video can be found in the Biomorph playlist. And let me know in the comments below if this is something you're looking forward to seeing more of. Also, why not press the like button and subscribe for more videos in the future. I'll see you in the next video.